guys. Made it to uh, Omaha, Nebraska. Just checking out the downtown for a minute before I get moving south. Uh, it's a pretty busy area, but here, you can check out this uh, Main Street is what I'm on right now. I don't know if you call it Main Street or just downtown. I think it's just downtown, but some cool statues and some old buildings. This double tree by Hilton is a huge building, but yeah, check it out. Just like that, we're out of the city. They wanted, uh, you know, money to park pretty much anywhere, of course, in the city. So I just did a loop through there a couple times and got out. I'm not really a big city person, obviously. Uh, if you watch my videos, you, you probably know that by now. But uh, Lincoln City was definitely way cooler than uh, Omaha, personally. I just kind of like the the setup of it. But, Anyways, he headed down to uh, Kansas City now to go south, to go east, if that makes sense. So, let's get moving. Well, we just crossed into Iowa. It's about the same as Nebraska. It's very similar moment at least. Probably won't be in Iowa for very long because then we go into Kansas and then back into Iowa or something like that. I don't know. Today is probably going to be a day of jumping states because of how the road goes. But at least we get welcomed by a beautiful sky. similar to the eastern landscape I'm familiar with so much. It's funny, I went into that Loves and I guess like I've entered into southern um, territory because they were playing country music in the gas station. Whereas like up in north of here, <laughs> everyone's been playing totally different music. So that's not country. Maybe we're here in the south now. I don't know if this is considered the south.
this is like a massive city. I'm not sure. There's a lot more to it than just like driving through it really, but I'm not trying to get lost. Maybe I am, I don't know. This is super cool. There was like a whole historic district back that I passed on the other side of it too that looked like it was very old. And this looks like a newer section. That's cool. Everybody's like, hey, look at the Overlander in the middle of the city with this poor runner. You're in the wrong part of the world, boy. Well, that's what happens when you build a vehicle that can do everything, apparently. The people are thirsty. Tom's town. It's like an old building. Truman Road. Cruising down Main Street. Well, that was, uh, I guess Main Street again? I, I'm not really sure. Let's turn down here and check this out. That's an old building. Wow. It looks like an old, like, I'm not really sure. Yeah, that, that's an old building. Oh, that's the library. Huh. That's cool. is uh, one way, I think. I'm not really entirely sure what, what's going on here. Wow, that's another cool building in front of us. Steam coming out of the, the ground. That is the Catholic Center. Baltimore Road and a bunch of other cool stuff. The historic New York Life Building. No idea where I'm going, but at least I get to see a bunch of cool history, historic building. bro yeah that's pretty much how you do a road trip uh, on a budget you just drive around in circles and see everything and don't pay for parking and just take your time and then uh, leave the city <laughs> um, yeah like I, like I said back in the last city I'm not really a big city person but you know if you're passing through the areas it's cool to see the historic buildings and um, you know see the area at least say that you've been to the city it's always cool but I wouldn't mind coming back to this one and, and spending more time 
like I've said before in other cities. So I guess over here on the, to the right is just like the water district or I'm not really sure. But we're going to St. Louis. Take the interchange on the left. You can see how much older this that all looks than the city, so that's why I was wondering if that was like the original city was down there and then the new city was built up on the hill here. I don't know. some like conservation land. I'm not really sure if, uh, if I have to like come back here and pay to pull off and camp somewhere or, or not really. I always say camp. I'm not really camping. I'm literally just parking and sleeping in the back of the forerunner. But I came all the way back here because I wanted to get away from, um, and my face is so dry still. But I wanted to get away from all the traffic and the noise of the, of the highway, so. I didn't get much sleep last night because I was so close to construction and city and highway. But this is out in the middle of nowhere out here, so uh, I don't know yet. We'll see what's up here. I mean, this literally just goes back to a parking lot, just like the other one did. So uh, there was another small pull off back there, too. So I guess I'm just gonna pull off and yeah, like this is it for the night. I don't feel like driving anymore. So this just says um, park and designated camp spots, but that's all I know or see. And there's no camp spot. <laughs> there's no camp spots. So I don't know. I'll get back to 